What? Hi, this is Sage of the Stage, and for the first time ever, I'm going to listen to So Hyang. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. I've gotten a lot of comments in the past half a year saying that I have to listen to her and that I have to react to her. And the comments were like, how come you haven't listened to her already? Uh, why are you avoiding her? I'm not avoiding her. I'm not avoiding anybody. There's just so many comments that I get. There are so many requests. And sometimes the best ones just slip past by me. I'm, I'm not proud to admit that, but it just happens. But today that's going to change. But first, I'm a singing coach and I teach singing every day through Skype, Zoom, what's video call or whatever works for you. If that's something you're interested in, check out my website, singerfting.com, consider booking a lesson. And if you book more lessons up front, there are some discounts. So check out my FAQ section of the page for more information about that. Or if you want, you can check out my Wizio page. You can book a custom reaction there or you can even book a singing critique. What does that mean? It means that you send me a clip of you singing. That can be an audio clip, video clip. You send it over and I respond in a short video format giving you some of my best tips so if that sounds interesting to you check out my wizio page anyway without further ado let's just jump into this video singing the legend wow It's like listening to an angel. Her voice is so sweet. It's like a bird singing. Wow, this is just perfect. Wow, her voice is so beautiful. First of all, it's very light, you know, it has this really bright color. Her voice is very high. I think the right term for this vocal type is coloratura sopranos. Uh, coloratura or coloratura or I'm not sure how to pronounce it in English. Coloratura, I believe, is the term when singers are singing these very fast notes. They're very quick. There's just a lot of these fast notes, almost like some kind of classical runs. Now, she's not singing that so far. I'm not even sure if she's going to sing that, but she has the voice that can sing that. She has this very light voice that can really go really fast, I believe. She just has this bright color, and I know her voice is flexible. It means that it's not slow. It means that it's not heavy. You know, she just feels like a, a breath of fresh air, like a breeze. She just has that beautiful color and it's so magical. She just sounds like an angel singing and I'm dead serious about that. If we were to write a song about heaven, she should be singing it because she just has the voice that will blend so much with that theme. Now, one thing that I would want you to pay attention to is this part. Uh, when she's singing, it's so correct that it almost sounds like auto-tune. I'm sure that she's singing without any pitch correction effects on her microphone chain, but it just sounds so correct that for a second, it just sounds, you know, too good to be true. For example, listen when she says cool. It's so straight. It doesn't have any vibrato. And that's kind of the thing that fools me for a second. Because auto-tune singers uh, sometimes overdo their vocals in the studio, you know? And they really make it so straight that it doesn't sound natural. It sounds robotic. But when she's singing, even when it's completely straight, without any vibrato, it just sounds natural. It doesn't sound like a robot. But still, listen to the way she sings this cool sound. It's so straight. I mean, what the hell? <laughs> so sweet. <laughs> ah, 
Uh, her voice is just beautiful. And listen, she does a little bit of these runs. Just listen to the way she goes downwards, this descending melody line. It's just so perfect. <laughs> okay, let's not go too much into detail, but let's go back to where we were. And even the backing vocals are so good. Wow. Okay, okay, let's just stop for a second because I, I'm, I just know that the things are gonna get so crazy from here on out. I can just hear it in the arrangement. What was that? I just thought she had this nice, bright, thin vocal that was just perfect and sweet, but she just exploded all of a sudden. She just had the perfect belt, you know, and it was so good. It just had the perfect amount of vibrato. It was just so great. When I started to listen to her, I didn't think she had this much energy in her. I didn't know that she can belt this good. But man, I can already tell that she's a technically flawless singer. This sounds so good. I will just rewind for about 15 seconds so I can really enjoy what's going to happen after this. Yeah! Wow. Yeah, girl. Oh, nice. Man, this is perfect. Listen to the drums. You have this percussions in the background. Just makes me want to run through the meadow. I have this, you know, natural feeling. Want to go to the nature. This is so good. That switch. Again. Now, I was focusing more on the singing, which is just brutally good, you know? So I didn't really have the time or I didn't really focus on the lyrics so much. But if I understood correctly, Arirang, or I'm not sure how it's pronounced, is a, a hill of a sort. And she's just singing about something in nature. I already said that it kind of reminded me of Meadows. The song has a little bit of that Celtic feel. If you've ever listened to Celtic Woman, for example, it just has that kind of vibe, you know, with those percussion instruments in the background and with this beautiful violin player, it just sounds altogether very nice. the backing vocals, just this conversation between them. <laughs> I like these switches. It just feels like a great song to sing along. <laughs> Everybody feels so proud of her. That was a very intense harmony in one part.
When will she stop? This is so crazy. <laughs> What am I doing with my life? <laughs> These singers are just so incredible. Man, this is perfect. I can't believe this is the first time I'm listening to Soul Hyung. Okay, now I think I can understand why some of you were getting mad because I didn't react to her already. <laughs> My bad, but I can't believe this is the voice that I've been missing all this time. It's like a missing ingredient on this channel. It's just perfect, powerful, and I like those switches. From belty notes to just that falsetto switches, it, they, were, they were so quick and so correct. I mean... And I know a lot of these things come from practice and good practice and smart practice, but a lot of these things that we've heard today come from her amazing ability to deliver emotion, to teleport us into another place. Because when I'm listening to her, I just feel better. I actually had a kind of a bad day and I didn't really want to talk about it, but, <laughs> but now I feel so great. <laughs> this is so good and I can't wait to listen to more. Anyway, that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, like it, share with your friends, consider subscribing and hit that bell to get notified about my next videos. If you enjoy what I do on the channel, consider supporting me through my PayPal me link by buying me a cup of coffee. Think about it. Coffees aren't that expensive, but every single thing adds up in the end and helps me make better and better videos for you guys. If you're interested in singing, check out my website, singeverything.com, consider booking a lesson and I can teach you a thing or two. Or if you want, you can send me a clip of you singing. That can be an audio clip, video clip. Send it over at Wizio and I will give you some professional pointers. You can also book a customer reaction video over at Wizio. Just send me the link to your favorite performance and I will upload a reaction slash analysis videos within days. And what can I say? You look wonderful and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye!